Now at six, a familiar face returns to Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. Superintendent Robert Runcie introducing the school's new principal. Michelle Kefford is a highly accomplished educator who was recently named this year's Principal of the Year for the entire state. Still, the issue that was top of mind at today's announcement was school safety. CBS 4's Joan Murray is live in Fort Lauderdale with more. Joan. And ever since the Stoneman Douglas massacre, uh, there has been great speculation on whether the principal at Stoneman Douglas, Ty Thompson, would be keeping his job. Friday, he made it official that he is leaving, and just a couple of hours ago, Superintendent Robert Runcie announced his pick to replace him. For some, it was a hug 15 months in the making as Michelle Kefford is named principal of Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, in a lot of ways, is going back home. It's where I started my career as an educator 20 years ago. I taught biology there for six years, and it was just an amazing experience. The dots connected on this one um, and aligned for us. We're going to take the love that we got lost on Wednesday, and we're going to spread that over the next day, weeks, months, and maybe even years. <clears throat> Kefford replacing Ty Thompson, who led the school in the wake of the mass shooting 2018. Friday, he said he was stepping down because of health and family. School board member Lori Aladeff, whose daughter was among the 17 killed, is relieved to see him go. He was not involved with threat assessments that led up to the shooting on February 14th, and um, there was no accountability. And I think Ms. Keffert will be a huge asset to the school, and it will bring our community together and help us with the healing process. My son is a freshman this year. He was at Westglades Middle School uh, during the incident when he was an eighth grader. Um, we were impacted as a family um, because he was in a portable classroom outside and saw a lot of the uh, students who evacuated the campus. Kefford has been principal of A-rated Flanagan High for eight years and won Florida Principal of the Year, but support isn't automatic at MSD. I would prefer it if we had Mr. Thompson back just because he was there for us after everything. I'm a senior, so hopefully for these other kids, you know, they get to see like the bright futures in them. So hopefully everything will turn out good. I will do everything that I can to ensure the safety of every member of my community that walks through my campus. So you see what her top priority will be now. This isn't totally a done deal. The school board, full school board, has to take a vote on this appointment, and that will happen in June. In Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.